6, a man accused of stealing a car gets quite the surprise when he realizes there was a young boy along for the ride. Our cameras were in court this afternoon as that suspected car thief faced a judge. 7 Action News reporter Kimberly Craig is live with what this guy did that led police right to him. Kim? Yes, and Southline police say Eric Sheffer has a criminal history that includes home invasion, narcotics, and auto theft, but this time he did not bank on a baby being in the back seat. And I don't think he could get rid of that car and child fast enough. Eric Sheffer is the 52-year-old South Line man who police say stole this Chrysler 200. And what he soon learned after driving off is that he was not alone in the car. A one-year-old baby was in the back seat. The thing is, is that it could have been so much worse. We talked to the baby's yeah. grandfather, David Post, on the phone, and it was his son who ran inside their house yesterday morning near Hagedorn and Orchard Ridge around 10 o'clock to grab the baby's shoes. But he left the child in the car with the keys. And when he came out, police say Eric Sheffer was already in the driver's seat and gone. We're talking 30 seconds, give or take, and he went out in the car with reaching down the street. Sheffer reportedly told police that as soon as he saw the baby in the back seat, he panicked, parked the car and tried to make a clean getaway. But police were already swarming the area and it was South Lyons police chief who spotted their likely suspect glancing over his shoulder. He wasn't uh, looking at the police cars, he wasn't looking at the police officers, and he was trying to leave the area just a little bit too quickly. And get this, Shepard left behind a pretty damning clue that he was the one who stole the car. He left his cell phone on the seat. Shepard was arrested and the baby returned to his father. He was happy as could be. I don't think he ever knew. The police responded so quickly and had him back with us that I don't think he was even aware of what I had won on. South Lion is a very, very safe community, but I don't want anybody to have a false sense of confidence. And you need to take your keys, take your children out of your car, and lock your car. And Sheffer is charged with stealing the victim's bank card and two counts of unlawful driving away of a motor vehicle. He's facing two counts because police say he admitted to stealing another vehicle last week. Reporting live, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News. Back to you. All right. Thanks a lot, Kim. Thank goodness that baby is okay.